The search for Chelsea's newest front of shirt sponsor continues. Uh, we're down to maybe three or four uh, options now with reports of, you know, this, that and everything else in terms of front of shirt sponsors, um, whether or not it's going to be another year's deal or if it's going to be more than that. Before we begin, please do like the video, subscribe, hit the bell notification to be notified of any future content on the channel. With that said, what we're going to get into is the deals on the table and what, uh, you know, sponsors are at um, our disposal, potentially, what, what we can have on the screen. Um, as we can see, Chelsea are and have been in talks with Qatar Airways. First reported, I think, back on the 24th, so two days ago um, from the time of recording here, um, but with Qatar Airways as the front of shirt sponsor. Last week, Qatar Airways signed a massive six-year UEFA Champions League deal worth £70 million a year. Um, as reported by Cave, the club is still negotiating with other major airlines, according to his source. Uh, the club's in contact with Ry uh, Riyadh Air, sorry, a, 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 a sponsor or a company rather that we've been in contact with for, I guess we've been, we've been rumoured with them. Um, uh, you know, over the last two years, we had sh people doing mock-ups of Riyadh Air on, uh, on the front of the last season's one. Uh, we had it on the front of this season's one, even before these reports had even been remotely sort of, um, you know, circulated or put into the atmosphere, so to speak. Uh, Turkish Airlines also on there. And um, from what was reported, as you can see on the next one, for the Turkish carrier, uh, it would be a second chance to become a shirt sponsor in 2015. Turkish Airlines had already been in contact uh, and initial agreement was worth £25 million per year. Um, but that, uh, you know, ultimately, subsequently collapsed because of our partnership with Yokohama, um, who are now or were, I think we're with Ling Long now. <laughs> we're with Ling Long tires now as our tire uh, sponsor, but Yokohama were our sponsor and then moved on uh, to become just our, our tire sponsor as a, fr uh, as a whole. So shirt sponsor, then tire sponsor. Um, we're now with Ling Long, I believe. Are we not? We might not be. I could be wrong. But either way, um, a deal did collapse between Turkish Airlines and Chelsea Football Club, um, subsequently going into Yokohama. Uh, for the ones that we've got, the, you know, the ones that we've got um, rumoured to be with us, the only thing that we really care about, well, first of all, before we go into, I'm, I've got some designs that I'm going to show you, uh, and not just some pictures, but I'll, I, I, I bring it, I'll bring it up. Just, just wait for it. Obviously, visually, people want it to be as aesthetically pleasing as possible, but also the, the, the deal, the deal, the deal is the most important thing out of everything. Um, not, in, not the most important thing, because you think back to three, it was hideous. It was absolutely diabolical, to say the least. You get Infinite Athlete, that was for a year, that was, you know, that did what it needed to do, and it was a very nice shirt sponsor, it really was. I didn't get it on this one, as you can see, I got the old... Uh, yeah, the, the blank one, but nevertheless, um, it was a very nice shirt sponsor. But we can't continue to do these one year deals. Um, it's just simply not possible for that to be um, a regular sort of ongoing thing. And with, uh, I mean, Opta Sports have, have recognized that Chelsea, with the way that we're going at the moment, are projected to get 66 points, which in the way that it's going at the moment, a fourth place finish, that's Champions League. The stipulations on these contracts are going to reflect that, and that is going to need to be Champions League football next season. We're going to have to come fourth as a minimum. As a minimum, we're going to have to come fourth in terms uh, of being able to continue and, and, and keep these uh, sponsorships afloat if and when and who we sign with. Now, the bit that we've all been waiting for is, of course, the um, the sponsors. And uh, as you can see, I don't quite know what's going on here. We're a bit zoomed in. So zoom out just a little bit. Um, here's the, 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 the home kit, as we all know and love. Um, well, 
some of us don't love necessarily because of the old squiggles, but nevertheless, um, the most important, I say the most important, but the one that's being touted the most, 50 million pounds a year is what's being touted. And um, it is as though Qatar Airways is the front runner to say the least. And uh, my oh my, it's an absolute beauty, is it not? It's an absolute beauty of a kit. And um, if we circulate through the um the the other kits as well we've got the shirt sponsors at the ready um here we go for this one as well the blue matching the sleeves and the and the, and the neck i think it's an absolutely beautiful kit it it already is I, you can't see it right now but it's right there it's right there on me wall um and it is it's one of the best looking kits we've had some time i'm still not a totally a fan of the of the badge but it, other than that, it's a, it's a spectacular kit, and needless to say, the uh, the, the third kit as well is a work of art. And uh, well, there's there's one of them already, <laughs> as we've already established Turkish Airlines. But Qatar Airways um, is, of course, um, the number one, the front runner. And I would, you know, be remiss if I didn't just go straight back to Turkish Airlines, um, which again, it's giving the the the, the infinite athlete sort of vibe. And I'm I'm not being I'm not lying to you. I'm looking at it dead on, and then I'm looking on it. On on the old editing for the for the for the video and it's come out it looks really nice i actually really like it putting it together wasn't hard obviously it's just a fucking it's a logo <laughs> but putting it together I, I i wasn't sure if i liked it i wasn't sure if i liked it at least on this one i think it looks pretty good um if we move back to this one i don't know i i, I really i don't know I, again i think that actually looks pretty decent you know I think it looks all right. What do you think? Let me know in the comments down below. Um, it, it's not as bad as you would think. Uh, at least, I don't know. I think this one's the one that looks the worst. But then again, I look to the left and it looks fucking fantastic. It looks really, really nice. Again, are they going to fall short of the asking price? That's the question. Um, as we move into the final one, and that is Riyadh Airway or Riyadh Air. It's really hard to convey the size of what is to be expected of the sp sponsor. It's not going to be that big because this is the belly at this point. And, and it's just, I don't like it. I don't like it. Like if they were to take this away and, you know, it just be sort of like that. Oh, hang on. If it was like that. <laughs> maybe i don't know i'm not sold i'm not so sure um and then we go into the other ones you've got turkish airlines get rid of that and then this one i actually really like this one i think this goes really really well um the blue again it's just the home kit for me it really doesn't do it for me it really really doesn't do it for me and last but not least you get rid of that beautiful Turkish Airlines logo and you put that in. And again, it looks really nice. So arguably, arguably all three kits, uh, all three sponsors look really, really nice on the, on the away kit and the third kit. But for me, it is the home kit that's letting it down. Will it come down to that being the case? Probably not. There's there's also um, rumors that it's going to be potentially, uh, you know, there's a there's an American company in the in the running for it as well. But these are the three um, companies now in the race, leading the race, Qatar Airways uh, leading it above all else um, with their 50 million reported 50 million uh, or rumored, sorry, 50 million um, in their offer. Can anyone come close? We will have to wait and see. With that said, let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. My name is Harry Up. Cheers and peace.